We've seen a lot of Max tracks here at the show, but I got to say, we haven't seen him being hauled around quite like this. Uh, what's the story here? Well, I uh, couldn't get campsite because I signed up too late, so I'm camped down the woods, and so I took my bicycle, and I knew I needed them. I knew I wanted them, so I made them into a little backpack. I'm going away happy. I love the ingenuity here. <laughs> You've even used the Max Track leashes that you can hook on to get them out of recoveries and things. And the bicycle is a, is a great tool for Overland Expo to get around and see everything, so. And as I'm bicycling, if I get stuck in a hole somewhere, I've got these to get me out. Exactly. <laughs> well, you have a great day, sir. Thanks, yeah. ride safe. So a lot of people come to Overland Expo to see new products and campers, all that sort of stuff. Some people come though for education and to learn things, including the kids. So over here, there's a kid's adventure area and they do all sorts of demos and things so you can leave here with some new skills to take to the trail. All right, well, Mr. Tom from Adventure Ready, we've been hanging out over here a lot. I almost sneaked into your booth. Almost, almost, <laughs> yeah. We, last, last minute changes, it yeah. is what it is. Yeah. But no, you're here supporting RLD and James Brood, right? Brood, rooftop tents, yeah. And we uh, also the distributor of North America for the RLD canopies and awnings and stuff like that. Yep, yeah. all of it, yep. You guys have seen these 360, if you've seen my videos, you've seen these 360 awnings and all that. Um, but yeah, it's fun to see your setup. You got this massive trailer with as many James Brood rooftop tents as you can fit on it. As many <laughs> as possible. I think we've got like eight, I think, set up here. Yeah, yeah mobile showroom, absolutely. Yeah, it's way cool. I've been loving mine. Um, run, I've been living in it about a month now, uh, yeah. lower, and then... Custom color, uh, gold metallic one. Yeah. Nice and flashy. Yeah, just like me. <laughs> no, it's been really fun, though, and cool. the quality and the comfort of that tent has been awesome, man. So, yeah. Yeah, I appreciate that, man. That's great. Um, the, the great thing about the fiberglass tents uh, versus the metal ones out there or the plastic ones out there is it's amazingly well insulated, so you probably notice it stays a lot warmer than most other tents. Mm -hmm only tent in the world that has true 360 degree windows you open those things up in hot weather and you guys got this any breeze that comes through vents a tent see all the way around you um, special materials the workmanship the quality of the craftsmanship and the materials and stuff is bar none every single thing is handmade in portugal in a family-owned factory uh, so uh, very top-notch stuff for sure yeah for sure. yeah and you guys definitely test the stuff uh you you were full-time for a little bit on, on the road uh, in the yeah. I've done it myself for sure for yeah. sure six months or so last year actually my uh, covid evacuation plan <laughs> <laughs> um yeah no they're, they're definitely meant to be lived in we actually employ a paris to car rally driver at the factory to do vibration testing on the rally cars we do wind tests up to 70 miles an hour uh probably the only tent you're going to want to be in anything above 50 miles an hour if you start walking around when it's real windy we get people coming up just blown away that tents don't move at all in the wind especially yeah. uh so yeah they're, they're definitely the ones that are research and development has gone into them far and beyond anything else out there mm -hmm. yeah absolutely heck yeah man well it's good to see you down south i haven't got up to the pacific northwest uh, like you know you as you soon as i want I got, to i got a big piece of property around the water for you beautiful campsite Ooh, we gotta go heck gotta yeah go. Gotta go. heck yeah, yeah. Well, thanks for chatting, Tom. Yeah, good good talking to you today, man. Of course. Anytime, man. Sweet. And yeah, check out Adventure Ready and uh, James Rude RLD. Yeah, absolutely. Sweet, man. Well, right. keep enjoying the show. It's Friday. It's about to get crazy tomorrow, so enjoy the absolutely. relaxing time now, absolutely. right? We got our little relaxing fire pit for the chill session tonight. <laughs> as much as you can. Sounds great, man. Cool. Well, we'll see you. All right. Thanks, guys. So we've seen some new products, all sorts of cool new campers and gear, but what are the people building? Best spot to check that out, the DIY showcase area. Best guy to talk to about that, my friend Timmy. What's up? <laughs> hey. Hi. <Hey. laughs> no, dude, it's really cool, though. You built this cabin on the back of your truck in yeah, Alaska, I, right? I totally did, mm -hmm. yeah. You drove it all the way here from Alaska. Yeah, I did. I just ruined everything you had to talk about. It's okay. I don't want to talk. <laughs> no, so how'd you get into the, the DIY showcase area? Um, a little bit of luck, persistence, and uh, the unique rig, I guess. Yeah. That's what they said. 
You yeah. built something cool. You filled out what a form online. Yeah, a little form online, a little piece of paper, save some money. You know. There you go. And here we are. It's like in the action, but it's not in the action at the same time. It's nice because it's overwhelming out there. It's like I think like twenty-eight thousand tickets I heard were sold mm -hmm. this weekend or something crazy. So I'm mentally overloaded right now, but I'm riding it out. Yeah. Um, but yeah, you guys have a sweet area over here. You're right next to the four-wheel campers and really yeah. part of the show. Yeah, that's ideal. Um, but people need to see this stuff. Like you don't need to go and buy your camper and all this. You can. Yeah. You can build it also. That's there are cool. options. You know, it's, I mean, it's definitely easier to buy, you know, but it's, uh, I don't know. It's yeah. fun to create your own. It's like, it, make, it feels good when you create your own stuff, you know. So, yeah. That's what it comes down to. Most definitely. And this place uh, last night was the most popping. It was seemed dead everywhere, you know. It was all dark. And I got, of course, I see Timmy's lights. And these are glass light bulbs, by the way, yeah, I'm going to mention. Broken. It's amazing. <laughs> I mean, you're mobbing behind us, you know. Oh, we were mobbing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right before this, we were on the road for like a week. Felt like a month. Yeah. Um, oh, you mean when we broke down? Yeah, you broke down. Yeah, yeah. 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 I don't. I don't mean to remind you. Yeah, thanks. Man. Yeah, no. Yeah. But he handled it like a champ. Always had a great attitude, I mean, pushing through. Just like, hey, this is the life. This is what we got to do now. Yeah, fix was, the breakdown. Yeah. What are you gonna do? You know, yeah. like nothing. Yeah. Just fix it or wait. Yep. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. No, but it's been really fun to travel with you behind this truck. How many people are inspired and just like, what is this? Um, how long did it take to build you? I guess I don't even know that. It's like a month and a half, two months, like just 14 hour days, just being psycho, you know, just getting it done. That's so quick. Fast. Yeah, it was, it was fast. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's super cool. I know tons of people are inspired to see it. So we wanted to show you guys a quick look at the truck house cabin and yeah. You can follow Timmy's Adventures Truck House Life on YouTube. Yeah. Right? Check it out. Check it out. Am I right? That's right. It's the on the side if you want to check it out. Put it in the plug. <laughs> That's the only way I can afford this trip, actually, is the diesel from YouTube. So There you go. Yeah, yeah but you you do videos a lot like I do. Just yeah, wing it, show your life, yep. not trying to prove anything. And yeah. I, I love them. I love the videos, man. I like your videos. I love your videos. <laughs> I love your videos. No, your videos are better. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is getting silly. We'll yeah, see you guys. <laughs>